All right, we got x squared minus x x equals 13. We want to figure out what solutions for x are available. For this problem, we probably want to complete the square. That's one way to do it. How I'm going to do this is I'm going to take this middle term here. So I'm going to take half of it and then square it so I get minus 6x. And then half of the middle term is negative 3. And then we square that so we get plus 9. And then to balance the equation, we add 9 to the right side as well. All right, so this breaks down to x minus 3 squared. And this is 13 plus 9, which is equal to 21. All right, or actually, that's, that's not right. It's uh, 22. Squ take square of both sides. And what we're going to end up with here is x minus 3 um, is equal to plus or minus square root of 22. And finally, our solution is going to be x is equal to 3. We add 3 to both sides. 3 plus or minus the square root, square root of 22. That's it.